Well, Mardi Gras can certainly work up an appetite, so you need the best of the best when it comes to food. I had a chance to visit a place that's been rated the top place to get a po' boy in all of America. Follow me as I take a journey to a place they call Parkway Po' Boys. Open in 1911, this mid-city New Orleans staple has always been the place for the absolute top po' boys in the city, and they start with the base of having it dressed and using fresh ingredients. Now, folks are standing in line with their suitcases, even if they're on their way to the airport, they want to get a piece of Parkway po' boys, and they even hand out pieces of king cake in line while you wait. I had a chance to ask the general manager his thoughts of the impact of carnival season. So, Mardi Gras season is wild. You know, people come from all over the world to see what this party is about, see what the fuss is about. And me and my team of 45 people, we got our own little Mardi Gras crew. And, and we're in here clanging and banging, you know, here when the chickens get up, we up too, you know, cooking and prepping and, and, and making sure when we open the doors for these masses, we are ready. So it's a, a lot of extra work behind the scenes that you don't see of us working 24 seven to keep up with this crew behind me. Now I did have to ask the coveted question when looking at the menu with so many good choices, I had to ask Justin myself, what would be his top recommendation if I was to order a po' boy from Parkway Bakery? So our most sought after po' boy, I would have to say is shrimp. A very close second is our slow roasted beef, roast beef sloppy, but that Louisiana shrimp is something everybody wants. You know, it's something I think I crave on a weekly basis. When I'm walking in that kitchen, and I just like, I'll pop those bad boys like candy, you know? And, and it's just, it's just nothing like a crispy fried shrimp po' boy and that fresh oil with that light batter. And you lay that on a warm toasted piece of French bread slather or mayo ketchup hot sauce. Like it. Ain't nothing like it. You can't come close with any sandwich. And, and we got one. It's like a it's like a poor man's steak and lobster. We got the Louisiana shrimp on a bed of our uh, slow roasted beef. We call it the surf and turf. Look, <laughs> plenty duplications, but we the ones who do it right. I'm gonna have gravy all in my suitcase because I'm bringing one of them back to Oklahoma. Coming up, I'll give you a recap of my whole experience for Mardi Gras so far as we get you ready for Fat Tuesday. I'm Rob Nice coming to you from New Orleans for Mardi Gras.